came into the fumble and Britt Johnson. Monday morning started off as any other for the New York Knicks. They attended shoot-arounds in the morning, then dismissed the players to go home and rest up before the game, which is where things got a little weird. Knicks point guard Derrick Rose attended shoot-arounds that morning, but when it was time to head back to the arena for the game, Rose was nowhere to be found. Prior to tip-off, Rose was named a starter for the game, so everyone was a little confused as to why he wasn't there. The Knicks were unable to reach Rose and started to worry when he never showed up for the game. After the game, Knicks center and longtime friend of Rose, dating back to their time on the Bulls, Joe Kim Noah, was the first to get in contact with Rose via a phone call and confirmed that Derrick Rose was okay and said this after the game. Derrick's uh, one of our better players. Uh, and <clears throat> when he's not here, it's, it's tough. Without Rose, Anthony Davis, who only played 29 minutes, dominated the Knicks, scoring 40 points and 18 rebounds before exiting the game with a left hip injury. X-rays were negative and Davis said his hip is just bruised and he should be good for Thursday's game. And the Pelicans, of course, went on to win the game 110-96. At the time of filming, much hasn't been released on why Derrick Rose missed the game. The Knicks hit the road to take on the Philadelphia 76ers on Wednesday and hopefully Hopefully Derrick Rose will be set to travel with the team. And we're not going to go into it, uh, you know, we'll, we'll, everything will become clear later on. We uh, uh, want to respect what, whatever he's going through and uh, we're just not going to comment on it. Well, we expect him back, sure. <laughs> uh, so, uh, just a matter of time. So what do you guys think happened to Derrick Rose for him to miss the game and not call? Let me know your thoughts below and make sure you subscribe to The Fumble before you go.